I didn't play a ton of sports growing up. I was like a very small kid. Uh, we have a video of me playing volleyball in middle school and the knee pads are like as big as my head and the volleyball is like crushing me. We started throwing frisbees for our dog. We had an Australian Shepherd growing up and uh, he needed a lot of exercise. So we all had to like throw frisbees for him 20 minutes a day. So my older siblings and I got, and my younger brother, we all got really good at throwing frisbees. And then Nate, my older brother, got into high school, found out there was a sport that went with it, tried out as a junior, um, and then got my sister into it. And then they got me into it when I was in middle school. So I'd kind of started playing, or at least knew what it was in middle school, and then started in high school. And that's when I actually started playing and working out and trying for stuff and had a little bit of growth spurt <laughs> and was happiest on the practice field in high school. Uh, it just felt like home. Uh, those feel like your family members. I played with the boys in high school because there was no women's team and they would like try to teach me how to lay out by putting a duffel bag on the ground and like making me run and then throwing right over the duffel bag so I had to like lay out or trip and I would just like end up running over the duffel bag and like I, I never launched like I couldn't figure that out. I had so many stupid like contusions and knee injuries from like just flopping. It was terrible. It took a while. I think I came in at a pretty unique time when like no girls were playing at that age so the fact that I could even throw a forehand was way better than most of the girls I was playing against um, so even though I was still terrible and like turfing throws and couldn't figure out where to go in the field I had that little extra boost of confidence just from having gotten to start early so I got to be on Junior Worlds in 2004 when I was 16, and I didn't play well at that tournament. I couldn't figure out how to get open, like definitely wasn't a star of the team by any means. So I think it was after that one that I kind of was like, I need to figure this out and like get good at this. So then in 2006, Junior Worlds is when I feel like I really gained confidence and felt like a leader on the team. I was always kind of following in the footsteps of people that had been there before. I do feel like I can be a little bit more of a leader on this team, not necessarily uh, telling people what to do, but trying to kind of be in a, recognize where we're going wrong or what things we're doing that maybe we can uh, fix as a team. Last time I felt like we played decent ultimate, we did what we needed to do to win, but there just isn't enough time to get to be the ideal mixed ultimate team, like we just don't have the time to put that in. But I would love to get closer this time, I guess. I want, I want to be better to I want to be better ultimate, mixed ultimate players.